Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 update or patch release, which is KB508295. This is an update released to the beta and release preview channels for the Windows Insider program, but this is an update that will soon come for the main build of Windows 11 because this update fixes a whole bunch of important issues and problems that we encountered in Windows 11 throughout the last few weeks. So if you want to receive this update earlier, you just have to join the Windows Insider program at least in the release preview channel and you just have to check for updates and you'll receive it in Windows Update. After you receive it, just click on install now and the update will be downloaded and installed. Basically, this update fixes a known issue that might prevent some users from opening or using certain built-in Windows apps or parts of some built-in apps. This issue occurs because of a Microsoft Digital Certificate that expired on October 31st, 2021. So this issue might affect the following applications snipping tool, touch keyboard, voice typing, emoji panel, input method editor, user interface, or IME UI, getting started, and tips. In this patch, Microsoft also fixes a known issue that prevents the start menu and settings app from opening as expected for the S mode only. Now we're gonna click on restart now, and then we will be on this new patch update. We will verify if the update was installed successfully, and then we'll check some of the apps that should now work properly after installing this update. So after you install the update, if you check Winver for the Windows version nothing will be updated here because this is only a patch update to check if the update was installed successfully all you need to do is to go into the settings app then to windows update and then update history and as a last update you should see this update kb 508295 successfully installed on the following date so let's quickly check some of the most important apps for example the snipping tool app had issues let's see if it's fixed now and as you can see it is fixed we can take screenshots we can use the app with no issues we can also use the touch keyboard without any problems that's really really good and also let me check the tips app and see if everything is working correctly and it should because Microsoft says that this is a part of this new update. So basically the tips app is working properly. So as I've said, if you want all these issues fixed, make sure to install the latest Windows 11 update, which patches all of these applications and you'll be able to use them without any issues. Make sure to join the beta or the release preview channel if you want to receive this update earlier or just wait because this update will come up for the main build in the following days or weeks. So if you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.